Okay. Hello, everyone. I'm Patrick from WCH. Yeah, we also have another name, Qing He Microelectronics. Today, I'm going to introduce WCH Grid 5 MCU application solutions. As you guys know, I trade about our Risk 5 MCU solutions almost every week. My talk has four parts today. In the first chapter, I will talk about the development trend of RISC-5 and WCH RISC-5 self-developed gene. And the second chapter, I will talk about the RISC-5 MCU application solutions. In the, in the third chapter, I will talk about the bridge chip of WCH, USB UART BLE, which can make RISC-5 development and chip interaction more convenient. In the fourth chapter, I will talk about the WCH RISC Fabs ecosystem. Now I'm going to the first chapter, WCH RISC 5. First, I I want to introduce our company. WCH is an IC complication interface and full stack MCU design company. The main products include interface chips such as Ethernet. Bluetooth, USB, and PCI, and a single chip MCU integrating the above mentioned interfaces. Yeah, you may have found that there's a trend in, in recent years that MIPS, CSKY, and Andis originally designed a custom instruction set called IP manufacturers, and they all turned to respond instruction sets. So, this hub is everywhere. The more players, the more perfect the ecosystem, which forms a good virtual circle. Now I'm going to talk about the WCH kernel design chain. In the early years, due to product application requirements, we developed an 8 bit single cycle risk core and integrated dedicated interface module such as USB, UART ports, etc. And designed USB to UART and a PD fast charging protocol, wireless, 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 wireless PD, wireless charger, and related products such as CH340, CH370 series chip. And the above mentioned product history has gone through more than 10 years of market inspection. And customs recognition of our product is still relatively high. By 2010 years, we have in implemented a single cycle design of indirect addressing instructions on the basis of the traditional 8, 8051 code and innovatively bring DMA into the 5.1 architecture and, and enhance the version of the E8051 code was designed. RAM access has been reduced from two to one circle and the e efficiency was improved by 50%. Based on the core number of cost effective MCU, Federal USB interfaces have been developed, and the shipments of the above mentioned series of chips have far exceeded billions. The key point is that they have not encountered a series of instruction compatibility problems. With the rapid with the rapid development of computer science and technology. The embedded application field has put forward high requirements for data transmission speed and operating power consumption. So we so we designed a variety of ARM thirty two bit calls around the twenty twelve years, and at the same time continue to innovate and expand in the field of interface collections and develop. 32-bit MCU that integrate USB 2. At the same time, in order to match the needs of high-speed interface applications, we also design high-speed DMA archivation mechanism. The company has been paying attention since the RISC-5 open source instruction set was 
of visionaries in 20, 40 years, around 20, 70 years due to the security needs of our, our security products, our company decided to adopt the risk of kernel. But at that time, the third part risk of core IP was not available. The core architecture was huge, huge and was not optimized for embedded MCU. It's not very suitable for our, our MCU products. Combining the company's many years of core self research experience and the company's later product needs, we finally designed, decided to design our own race five core. And we have uh, by so far, we have have self developed this five kernel such as Chinker, V2, V3, V4, V5, which was used inside inside the shapes of USB3, CH569, uh, general purpose MCU, CH32V series, and our Bluetooth MCU CH. 573 or and CH583, CH5882. Yeah, at this point, I want to explain what a full stack MCU is, which is also called the full stack self developed microcontroller unit. Classic MCU generally ad ad adopts the SOC mode based on IP integration and assembly which is similar to the industrial division, division of VPC and the main components include core IP, basic digital peripherals IP, basic analog peripherals IP, and professional peripherals IP. The picture on the left is the classic MCU architecture mode. The, and the picture on the right is, is the WCH 4 stack MCU architecture mode. The middle part is the the middle part is the the middle this this part, including timer timer UART port SPI, PWM GPIO four speed USB, ADC DAC amplifier, etc. This part of the basic IP MCU manufacturers are generally self developed. However. Professional peripheral IP, we can look at the bottom of this picture, including controller and high-speed analog transceiver, by involving RF and even baseband algorithms, peripherals that require communication protocol stacks, and even drivers such as high-speed USB, Ethernet, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, etc. Most most MCU manufacturers purchase third-party IP parts. WCH has all self-developed and built in a single MCU chip. The, the advantages brought the advantages brought by the WCH full stack MCU are that it's conducive to global optimization of applications, reduces the steps of communication and cooperation with other IP manufacturers and and EMI and does not need to pay licensing fees and royalties to third parties, which reduces the cost of terminal products and is completely independent to control. Based on the research on the risk file instruction set architecture and the micro architecture of years of experience in interface design. We finally form the MCU Plus product line with one core and three interfaces as the technical feature. The concept of one core and three interfaces is shown in the fig on the right. One core is, is based on the self-developed restart core, and the three interfaces refer to Bluetooth, Ethernet, and USB. MCU with integrated Ethernet interface and if the latest product stack are independently developed, MCU with integrated Bluetooth 5.3 version, including Bluetooth baseband, Bluetooth 
protocol product, product, product stack, five transceiver are all independently developed. The MCU with integrated USB interface has the rate of 480 meg BPS. And the built-in file is all independently developed. I'm going to the the second chapter, WCFSI MCU application solutions. The first one is low power consumption. Yeah, the self-developed desktop enables general purpose MCU low power performance. The above picture shows the major power consumption of the three chips in four different operating modes. It's easy to analyze that the power consumption of the general purpose MCU F103 is much higher than that of the other three chips in the four operating modes of run, sleep, stop, and standby mode. And its, it's performance is weaker than the general purpose MCU V203 and F203. The power consumption of V203 in run and uh, sleep modes is better than that of the low power dedicated MCU L051. The power consumption of V203 in run mode is 44 microampere per megahertz. The power consumption of V203 in sleep mode is 17 microampere per megahertz, and the power consumption of L051 in stop and standby mode is better than that of V203. V203 and L051 have their own advantages and disadvantages in terms of low power consumption. Now the the fact I'm going to I'm going to talk about the high speed performance of USB. Yeah, this picture shows the comparison of USB read and write write speed test in three modes, and and this this W is W is the writing speed that is that is downloading. And R, and R is the reading speed that's uploading. The data transmission performance of the USB 5 chip 333300 and CH132 are basically the, the same. The transmission speed of, of V307 is, is higher than the F407 plus 5 gaming that uses, that uses library functions for USB transmission. And it's also higher than the, uh, the F407 plus 5, 5 gaming that use registers for USB transmission. This also proves, this also proves the advantages of built-in professional IP. The USB communication distance can can reach can reach ten meters, which is compared with the standard requirement of USB five meters distance. People people who have got our V three O seven developer boards can actually verify it. This also proves the advantages of built in professional IP again. According to the actual situation of our Bluetooth low energy and ethernet applications, we feel that adding customer instructions that can support half world and fight six bit compression, C point L B U C point L H U C point S B C point S H. After adding the compression instruction, we did an actual comparison test. Take our Ethernet protocol stack code as an example. After adding the customer compression instructions and compiling without adding compression instructions, the code den density is reduced by about six points. 
six by six percent. The third, I'm going to talk about the Ethernet to eight UART solution. Eight serial server is an open source project designed based on V307, the seven rich peripheral resources. Convert the UART data into a TCP IP protocol network data. Realize two way transparent data transmission between the theory port and the network interface. And extend the communication distance of the theory port device. This application is usually used with industrial routers or industrial switches. For example, remote weighing, remote attendance, remote access, gate control, etc. The stop the 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 software the software and hardware source code of the project has been open sourced on this on on this GitHub address. If you are interested, download and submit PR. Now um the four the fourth solutions I'm going to talk about is USB to JTAG SPI solution based on single RIS5 MCU V30 V305 chip built in high speed USB 5. The high speed USB to, to JTAG device solution based yeah can be used to debug. And, uh, and program devices such as devices such as CPU, DSP, FPG, and CPOD. This solution only needs one one chip and does not need a CPU or other USB five USB five five or auxiliary chips. This this project is is also open source on this GitHub on this GitHub address. If you are happen to want this application, try them out. The JTAG, the JTAG debug and program built in the current solution is named USB2 JTAG using the customer bit band and byte shift protocol transmission mode in which the JTAG writing speed can reach 36 megabit Per second, and the host computer software uses open OCD. After the interface of of OJTAG, open OCD will support the operation of USB to JTAG to realize the JTAG download and the debug function. The target FPG used for downloading is is in this program is Stanix Part Six XD Six SLX Nine. The picture on the right is this the program speed comparison with the programmer on the market. The size of the program, the target file is 333k bytes. The speed of V307 is 3.33 megabytes per second, and the other program speeds are much lower than the USB jetpack program based on based on V307 design. Yeah. Now I'm going to talk 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 about the third third chapter. WCI USB UART build chips. Yeah. Uh, we all know that WCI USB to UART build chip is very powerful. Now the latest third generation USB serial port build chip it has many advantages such as I/O voltage supporting 5, 3.3, 2.5, 1.8 voltage. The maximum baud rate can reach six mac bps. WCH has also designed some pin compatible USB UART bridge chips according to the needs of our customers. The USB four bit physical layer is is twelve mac bps half duplex. Yeah, you know. Considering the USB protocol and CRC overhead, when serial communication at the rate of six meg BPS and above is used in both sending and receiving, 
the theory communication must be discontinuous transmission. There will be time gaps between packet packs. To achieve a continual transmission without an interval, a high speed USB to UART chip such as CH347 can be used. Yeah. We also support USB remote wake up function through Siri port RI. This function can be configured whether to enable or not. And the WCH USB UART free chip also supports the use of the system's built in CDC driver or the official VCP manufacturer's driver. It's recommended to use the VCP driver by default, which has more complete functions and better performance. This picture shows the BOE2 UART free chip CH9141. Only to, only to connect a crystal and two capacitors, CH9141 can work and the application is very simple. The minimum sleep power consumption is 0.3 microampere. The maximum baud rate is 1 Mbps. This picture shows the USB BLUR 3-way bridge chip. CH9143, we have provided USB BLE virtual serial driver. There's no so there's no no need to learn about USB and BLE technical details for customers. Now I'm going to talk about the WCH Racer ecosystem. The first thing is to talk about how to make Racer MCU development more convenient. So we provide the two wire high speed debugging. WCH link, which can support ARM MCU and RISPR MCU. We also improved the programming speed of RISPR MCU. The enhanced version of WCH link we have released so far takes only 2.1 seconds to program a 54k byte object file. The WCH link looks 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 like like they they looks the the same the same surface. The classic version and the enhanced version, they share, they share the, the same board, but the, the main chip is different. The classic version chip is CH549. The enhanced version of WCH link chip main chip is CH32V305FBP6. For the convenience of customers who have used our ARM MCU, they, if they want to convert to RISP MCU, we also provide a one-click project conversion function based on Mount River Studios IDE. Just need to just need to hit hit this button, then the project will convert to RISP M project. If you want to reduce the density of the project code. We also provide this function. You, you need only need just just check this option to enable custom compression instructions to reduce the density of the compiled code. In addition, RD three V three O seven BSP has included all peripheral drivers, so it's. It's very convenient for you to design your own RT3 OS, IoT OS project. This, this, this picture shows how to create RT3 project view Mount River Studio IDE. It's also very convenient. We always have the WCH ecosystem plans. So if you have have ecosystem cooperation or technical discussion needs, just scan the QR code to add my WeChat or Twitter. That's all for my talk today. Hope you guys enjoy my talk. Thank you. Bye.